Welcome back to Good Day Sin Law. Carla Kirby joins us today with updates on what's happening at the Rapids Parish Library. Carla, thank you for joining us today. Yeah, thank you for having me. Happy Mardi Gras. Yes, yes. happy Mardi Gras to you too. <laughs> yes. Uh, yes, we're so festive today. I know, I know. <laughs> I wish I'd worn beads, I forgot. I know, <laughs> it's, it's okay, it's, it's okay. okay. <laughs> um, so there's a lot going on yes. at the library, just like normal, but y'all are getting ready for some pretty big events We too. are, we're excited, yeah. One of our biggest events coming up is Creative Con, so we're so excited about that. That's um, March the 4th. Um, and it's at the West Side Regional Library, and it's just a full day of events. There is a paint pouring um, kind of demonstration, not demonstration, you get to do it also <laughs> at right. the beginning, but we have special guests throughout the day that are gonna do panel discussions, um, Dan Forrest, um, AKA, um, cosplay they're gonna do some different on how to get into movies and how they got into and how to get in cosplay and oh, okay it's gonna be so much fun and it's a really good day for the whole family there's going to be obviously you can dress up in whatever costume from whatever fandom geeky cool thing you like <laughs> it's kind of runs the gamut um, okay so cosplay is that like costume play? yes okay. like they dress up okay. and it, it can get really intense and realistic but also if you oh. just for fun want to wear something that looks yeah. like a character yeah we, you can go as as hard into it or just as easy and fun as you would like okay. um, but really any fandom anything you're excited about like come and celebrate a lot of people do like uh, Marvel characters people do you know Harry Potter stuff like horror movies it's just anything that you're a big fan of anything yeah. goes and we will have games um, for kind of the serious gamers we'll have like Dungeons and Dragons but then like some kind of just easy come and go card games tabletop games so the kids can just come play a little walk to the next thing yeah, yeah. so We'll have food vendors there. It's it's just a really fun day. Awesome. Yeah, so it's so for much. kids and adults yes, to dress up. It is great for the whole family, all ages. Obviously free and open to the public from 9 to 2 on the 4th. Yeah. Awesome. Well, that'll be a lot of fun. It's so much fun. And I did want to mention uh, we have so many persons, like in-person programs, but sometimes people can't get to the program to kind of stay for an hour or two. So we always have grab and goes which is fun yeah uh, we started it during COVID, and people loved it so much we kind of couldn't stop <laughs> they were like please keep these so depending on the branch we have them for teens children and adults and you just grab that little kit and it'll have all the supplies you need and the directions to make a cool craft at home just at your own pace pace whenever you have a chance how cool yeah and so we're excited about that because it really helps everybody be able to be a part of programs even when yeah you're rushing in the library 15 minutes before closing when you get off work you can still participate in those programs absolutely yeah. how do we find out more about where we can get the grab and go yes so just call your local branch um, all branches have them but depending on the branch some have you know adult ones some may just have teen um, um, so yeah, call your local branch or talk to them next time you're in and ask them, hey, what, what grab and goes do y'all have right yeah. now? And they can let you know, because it, yeah, every month it rotates, we have new things. Um, Victoria, our STEAM, STEAM um, programming manager, she makes those grab and go kits and um, yeah. They're always, always different and fun. How yeah. fun. Mm -hmm. And what a great way for kids to have a little yes. project to work on, especially while they're out of school right oh, now, yeah. too. And adults. You know, we do have so many adults that, yeah, don't get a chance to come in. But for those who do, we have such good adult programs right now as well. We always have the painting classes. Um, we have... A really cool thing at several of the branches called as young as you feel day Ooh. and that is for our senior adults and so they get to come and we have bingo there's food but it's really just a fun time for them to kind of get out and socialize with other people um, it is so popular everywhere people love as young as you feel day it's just <laughs> a fun you know time to get out and chat with other people yeah, and yeah socialize. Just, yeah and, and bingo I mean everyone loves bingo oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I yeah. love bingo oh, it's yeah. Great. yeah so that's always a fun one we also have some cool um, things every month at the main library we have for the love of food so we have a different chef come in each time and do a food demo fun. yeah if you come you get to try the food too but you'll get a kind of print out of the recipe and how to make it and we even upload that to our YouTube page so wow. you can see it from home but awesome. yeah now we I say we have chef we have some home cooks as well that do it occasionally right. but you learn a new recipe and if you come you get to sample that awesome. <laughs> so, yeah. that sounds like a good time and of course we have this painting class so many things and then for teens this month we had candy making next month I think it's an escape room if that yeah but we have tons of stuff for teens and of course for kids you know story times all the fun activities always awesome. yes awesome mm -hmm. and what's that website for people who want to find out yes. more if you want to find out more go to our website rpl.org and also our Facebook page is always up to date with our events and programs as well fantastic Carla thanks for coming on the yeah, show today telling us all about me. it we appreciate it so much thanks of course